All right, gang, it's uh, July 11, 2024. Um, this just posted. This is the next list of dogs to be executed at the world famous Apple Valley Execution Center, uh, also known as the Morgue, also known as the Slaughterhouse. Uh, good old fashioned, just don't give a shit. Look at these beautiful creatures. This nice lady works her ass off to uh, to to figure out uh, what dogs they're unlisting to kill, and uh, she is a big mover and shaker in saving these lives. So in the next, probably tomorrow morning, um, I'll have, uh, you know, yeah. I'll have more information on them. Um, now it looks like she posted their, uh, their information here. Hopefully somebody's going to want to get involved and help these guys out. Um, here's another one. Flora. Man, this is, this is, looks like, this dog looks like so much fun. Sybil. He's a big guy, a big girl. Um, and um, this little black guy. Remy, there he is. Remy, little little black dog. Be a great dog for somebody. Here's a little bit bigger black dog. His name is Alan, or Alla. Can't really see that well. The tiny script, and then here's Sirius, or Cirrus. Yeah, beautiful guy. Always hope they all get out, but... And then here's Fiona. Beautiful blonde dog. Emma. And here's the group of six here. Here's a group of five. And, um... So there, there is their information. It's really sad they have such a, a low value of, of a dog life to just kill anything and everything. And then if you want to come over to uh, um, the Instagram, if you don't have uh, Facebook, um, here's the list of the names of the dogs and their numbers. Um, they have until noon tomorrow to get rescued or adopted. This just that's just horrible. Holding these creatures ransom just to kill them. You know, this this place is just so despicable. I just can't even put into words how despicable this place is. I, you know, I saw this today. Um, anyone who has accustomed himself to regard the life of any living creature as worthless is in danger of arriving also at the idea of worthless human beings, human lives. Oh, if that doesn't say it all, I don't know what does. This place is just such a rotten, a rotten shithole. You know, this is, this is the kind of person you'd get for animal control. Remember this guy? Edward Kemper killed eight women, including his own mother. At 13, he killed a neighborhood cats and put their heads on poles. Kemper killed his own cat, decapitated it, and cut it into small piece, pieces. This is the same thing he did to his mother. You know, if you can kill little puppies and dogs, well, then that's, that's the kind of person you are. This, this is a great one. Abandoning your cat, your dog or cat is animal abuse, animal cruelty, knowing they will not be adopted and just killed by sadists. 
Boy, ain't that the truth. Um, I think this is today's list of dogs to be killed, or yesterday's. Let's take another look. I thought I, I, I saw a safety thing on these guys. Yeah, this is just absolutely despicable. They don't give them a chance. They just want them killed, you know? And then, of course, you got all these beautiful cats that they're just getting killed left and right. Like this guy here. God, just, just horrible. The guy's just absolutely terrified. You know, if they put this kind of effort into spay and neuter, um, it, this shit would just not be happening. God, I thought this Aurelia cat dog got saved. Maybe not. Let's see what they got over here. <clears throat> yeah, oh, there it is. Okay. So Aurelia, the one with the round ears, is safe. And Bud is safe. Jennifer, Jackal. Remus and Melanie. Let's hope they get out. Beautiful dogs. Yeah. Anyway, I just want to do a quick one, gang. We've been covering a lot of dogs lately. Uh, here's Z, red listed. So, I got, uh, my take is the dogs have to go get to this status where they're on the official kill list. Um, but I, I think that... I think they just kill a whole lot of other dogs that we just don't even know about, you know. That's my that's my take. Um, but maybe we could get these guys at home too. Melanie and Remus. There's a boxer and there's a German Shepherd. Makes somebody a great dog. Um, you know, I can only focus on so much. You know, is uh, is uh, Apple Valley's. Uh, Dogs. Um, try to put some cats on the on the YouTube and and the, and the Instagram has got the cats on it. Um, people just aren't that passionate about cats like they are dogs. Uh, this place loves to kill um, pit bulls and pit bull mixes, and um, so hopefully this guy gets out. Big beautiful dog. Lots of German shepherds here. Lots of them, but seriously, if these people, if these people put the effort into spay and neuter, for how much money they get a month? They get eighty-five thousand dollars a month from San Bernardino to kill dogs and cats, and to give some jackass a bonus. God, what, what if you spent that eighty-five thousand dollars a month on spay and neuter for this Apple Valley area and the surrounding areas? Just spend that whole eighty-five grand on on a team of vets and uh, techs and just spay neuter you know th this this would be happening you know these people wouldn't have a job so god there's just so many of them and and they just they don't give a shit they're happy to kill them all you know there's some beautiful dogs that got killed this week really beautiful dogs you know you know and then here's another thing Think about this. You got the ASPCA, the Humane Society. These are fat cash charities. The people that run these charities, they get they get millions of dollars in bonuses and raises and, and salaries. I mean, they can go down to Aspen and buy any type of house they want, Santa Barbara, Montecito, buy any type of house they want with all the money that they rake in off these suckers who give them money. Have you ever heard of either one of these big charities and they're not really charities. Have you ever heard of any of these charities going into a place like Apple Valley and spending, you know, a million bucks, 500,000 bucks, and just spay and neuter, you know, until they run out of cats and dogs to spay and neuter? The Netherlands did that. They don't have uh, shelters like the United States. And, I, and you know, I don't, I don't like to call them shelters because they're anything but that. They're kill stations. These creatures go there to get killed. They don't go there for any other reason. Um, and the, the whole 
the whole cure is spay and neuter. It's not aborting dogs and cats, it's spay and neuter. And it's very easily done. Um, anyway, gang, there it is. Let's just take another quick look at the beautiful dogs that are getting smoked. Um, here they are. And they're on the Instagram as well. And, um, yeah, so there it is, gang. I hope you get involved. I hope you pray for these creatures that they get out alive. Um, that this horrible place gets shut down somehow, some way. And people find out about the, just the atrocities that go on in this place. Um, th there's shit I just can't even mention on here that is just so horrible. Um, but somebody else, somebody else will. So, help if you can. We'd really appreciate it. Catch you on the next YouTube.